hello you welcome back all right so we are going to be looking at algebraic fraction in this video now what's an algebraic fraction an algebraic fraction is a fraction in an algebraic expression okay so it's a fraction but it, that fraction is not numeric but it's in an algebraic expression and here we have an example okay of such fraction that we are to simplify now the way we simplify algebraic fraction is still the same way we simplify okay the same way we actually simplify uh numerical numeric fraction okay please follow me this way we simplify numeric fraction okay and uh, and that's actually who is by taking the LCM of the denominator now I have some question simplify the following fraction so I'll start with uh, with a part of the question okay now for me to simplify these two fractions then what I'm gonna do is of course I will have to draw my division sign okay now I find the LCM of, my, of the denominator the LCM of the denominator is simply okay the product of the denominator so in algebraic fraction first to actually get the LCM of the denominator we just multiply the the the, the denominator simple right so I multiply x plus s plus 2 I'm applying s plus 2 by x minus 1 okay then I start dividing s plus 2 divided by x plus 2 I'm left with s minus 1 then I multiply s minus 1 by 3x so this is gonna be 3x multiply x minus 1 okay then I bring down the my minus I go again s minus 1 divide divide uh, did, divide the denominator then the s minus 1 will cancel s minus 1 I left with s plus 2 then I now use it to multiply 2x so that's gonna be 2x open bracket x plus 2 so I can simplify the I can simplify the numerator right so I'll have to put the bracket 3x multiplied by x gives me 3x square 3x multiplied by minus 1 gives me minus 3x okay I'll go to this don't forget the minus front of the 2s minus 2s multiplied by x gives me minus 2x square and of course minus 2s multiplied by 2 that gives me minus 4x okay so I still need to bring down my my denominator s plus 2 and of course x minus 1 okay so what's the next step I have to color like times together 3s square minus 2s square gives me just 1s square minus 3x minus 4x gives me minus 7x and that is my final answer okay so I'm having s square minus 7x divided by x plus 1 s plus 2 then multiply by x minus 1 okay let's now look at the b part of the question the b I have 2x minus 1 divided by x then of course plus x minus 1 divided by x plus 1 so what's my LCM okay so LCM is the product which of course is x times x plus 1 okay so x divide x I'm left with x plus 1 and I now use it to multiply the numerator so I'm having the numerator which of course is 2x minus 1 
multiplied by the result of my division, which is x plus 1. I have to bring down my plus. Okay, I'll, I'll go again by division. This cancels this and left it x. So that's going to be x. Now multiply the numerator, which of course is x minus 1. Okay, so let's do this. So I have to expand this. 2s multiplied by x. That gives me 2s squared. 2s multiplied by plus 1, that's going to be plus 2x. Now I go to 1. Minus 1 multiplied by x gives me minus x. And minus 1 multiplied by plus 1 gives me minus 1. Let's open this bracket. x multiplied by x, that gives me x squared. Then x multiplied by minus 1 gives me minus x. Okay, then I have to divide by my denominator x plus 1 okay so the next step is to collect like terms and of course simplify 2s square plus s square gives me 3s square 2x minus x gives me 1x okay and 1x here minus 1x that gives me 0 so s is gone so I'm left with just minus 1 okay then of course divided by the denominator x open bracket x plus 1 I'm done with that okay so let me clear up the screen so that I will do justice to the last question. Okay, here the last question I have. So the question is, what is the LCM of the denominator? This, this, and this. Okay, so of course you know that the highest uh, factor of S plus 1 is being represented by S plus 1 square. So I don't need to multiply by this again. All I just need to do is get my LCM, okay? x plus 1 square then times x plus 2 of course you know this now okay has actually taken care of this because s plus 1 square is also the LCM of s plus 1 okay it's a factor of s plus 1 or it's a multiple of s plus 1 please pardon me so now let's start dividing s plus 1 squared divided by s plus 1 squared that is 1 I multiply 1 by 1 I have 1 minus I bring down the minus s plus 2 divide this this can so that I have s plus 1 squared multiplied by x so that's going to be s into s plus 1 squared then of course what s do I have to do Okay, s plus 1 cancels this. I have s plus 1, then multiply by 3x. That gives me 3x. Open bracket. s plus 1. Okay, so let's simplify. So this is going to be equal to 1. s multiply by x that's giving me x square minus x multiplied by x that's giving me x square oh please pardon me i have to simplify the bracket first i have to expand pardon my mistake expanding this of course if i have to expand this i'm gonna i can i will apply a shortcut okay i'll square the very first uh the very first term there which is x square they use two to multiply two times x times one 2 times s times 1 will give me 2x. So the second term will be 2x. Then, of course, the third term now is not going to be 1 square. 1 square is 1. Okay? Alright. Then, of course, plus, I cannot expand this one here. 3x multiplied by x gives me 3x square. 
3x multiplied by 1 gives me 3x. Okay. So now it's time now for me to let me still divide by my my by my denominator x plus one all square then multiply by x plus two okay so let's start let me have to open have to open this bracket so it's gonna minus x multiply by x squared that's gonna give me minus s cube minus s multiply by plus two x that's gonna give me minus two x square and minus s multiplied by plus one gives me minus x okay so bring down this 3x square plus 3x all right then of course divide by x plus one square then x plus two Okay, so now let's start collecting light terms. Minus s square. Okay, doesn't have any light terms. So s cube, please. But the minus s cube doesn't have any light terms. So I'm gonna have. Okay, let me start. The whole number one. Okay, doesn't have any light term. Minus s cube. There's no light term. Then let's go to minus two s square plus. 3 s square that gives me plus 1 s square then I have minus x plus 3 x that give me plus 2 x so then divided by bracket open x plus 1 all square then x plus 2 so that is how we simplify algebraic function okay so see you in the next video for more questions thank you very much